Yeah. Well, I averted disaster. And I mean, like, big time. So, on the Turbine Llama, the exhaust hits right on the uh, tail rotor area. It's always been kind of warm, something I've watched. Well, today, I decided that the uh, nylocks on the uh, bolts holding these two nuts right here, there's one on this side and there's one on this side. Best I can theorize is that the heat finally cooked out the nylock and I lost the two bolts. So I had one bolt holding this one right here, holding on the whole tail rotor. Consequently, it, it was pretty windy today, so it rotated around and was enough to, with, with just this, it was enough to get over there and make contact. So all of my, all three of my tail rotor blades are chunked and missing. This one really got it bad on here. It's chunked. So I'm uh, missing bolts. So I guess now is a really good time to go through and make a major repair on here because it's been, it's been repaired before. So, and when it was repaired, uh, these little tabs that are right here got uh, put on slightly crooked. So I'm gonna fix those now so that my tail rotor is actually straight up and down instead of cockeyed like it is right there. So this will be a process and yeah, it, it sucked. It flew, I've, we heard something we thought was tape because the tape comes off of these things a lot and that's kind of what it sounded like, but no, it was actual carbon. So the tail rotor is kind of fuckered Gonna give me some new blades. And yeah, you can see where the tape has come off. So we thought, okay, well, we'll just, no big deal. Stopped and Jack was like, what the hell's going on here? Oh, your blades are, dirt. oh shit, it hit, the, it hit the boom. Oh shit, you're missing two bolts. Two of the three. So yeah, we're gonna get this fixed because we got shit to do, shit to fly. And upon closer inspection, I looked at it and there are no nylock bolts securing this. So it was just Loctited in there and I ran a bolt through there and you can see right there where it uh, started to get into the actual block. So it was just the Loctite and we all know that Loctite will come loose with heat. So that's the only thing I can think that uh, is uh, the culprit here because this was the one that was left and it was still in there pretty tight but it's kind of behind all this stuff whenever you're talking about the turbine heat getting to it so no nylocks so i'm pretty sure that the uh loctite which is still in here there's i ran when i ran it through it was still kind of snug but not enough to hold it in so we're gonna Go through and try to do some repair on the, where we made contact. I got to figure out what this is. This looks like a little piece of brass, and I think this is, I think this is stainless. So we're gonna see. We're gonna do some testing and see what we can do. If I can cut this out from say here to here and replace this one piece with something solid instead of all these little pieces soldered together. We'll see, and then we'll get this all cleaned up and we're gonna repaint it and check some other stuff and go from there. Yeah, 